thing, uh, you know, what about democracy? That, that gets mentioned too, is if the issue here is institutional, is it, is it really, you're talking about political reform more than you're talking about economic reform? Well, I, I think they're tied together. Okay. And uh, exactly. I think that uh, a, a, a democracy can be established, mm -hmm. of course, at the stroke of a pen by creating new institutions, by creating mm -hmm. a parliament, by mm -hmm. uh, decreeing that there are going to be elections. Mm -hmm. It won't be mm -hmm. a stable democracy mm -hmm. unless mm -hmm. there, there's something mm -hmm. to prevent Mm -hmm. rulers from becoming autocratic. Okay. In every system, including our own, there are rulers, there are statesmen mm -hmm. who would like to stay in power. Stay in power mm -hmm. and do things the way they want, mm -hmm. uh, pursue policies, mm -hmm. the policies that they want, mm -hmm. even if the, the people don't, uh, don't agree. Mm -hmm. uh, in democracies, the reason, in, in stable democracies, the reason the political system is stable is not mm -hmm. because you have democratic people in power, mm -hmm. it's because statesmen, policy makers, uh, uh, presidents with autocratic ten tendencies just can't get, the, get their way. Mm -hmm. In the Middle East, there's very little to stand in the way, mm -hmm. stand uh, in the way mm -hmm. of a, a ruler mm -hmm. uh, who wants to stay in power against the wishes of uh, the, the people. Right. And that goes back to a point I've made uh, before, the civil society mm -hmm. is weak. Why is the civil society weak? Mm -hmm. uh, for many centuries, uh, the uh, private organizations were organized as WACs, mm -hmm. which were not self-governing and could not participate in politics and therefore could not provide the checks and balances that are necessary for democratization and for, uh, uh, for uh, keeping, uh, uh, keeping democracy uh, uh, stable. So the uh, Middle East has, uh, it's only very recently that uh, groups in the, the Middle East and the rest of the Islamic world have been able to form private organizations, mm -hmm. uh, organizations that are not controlled by uh, the state that can actually stand up to uh, the state. These mm -hmm. such organizations do exist, but they're, uh, they're very few and they're generally, uh, generally weak. Fortunately, the trend is toward stronger civil societies. Uh, this is going to take time, though.